Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to give a quick demo of how the Event Calendar Newsletter plugin works. So it depends on another plugin to be installed, and in this example I've got the Events Calendar. So it's a very popular Events Calendar plugin allowing you to add uh, Events Calendars to your website. So you need to make sure you've got some events in uh, whatever plugin you're using. So we support a couple right now, and if yours isn't supported, be sure to let us know. So I've got two events here, one on June 6th, one on May 28th. They've got descriptions and dates uh, in them, so they can be pulled in uh, to a newsletter. So you would then go to Event Calendar Newsletter after you've got it installed and activated. You've got uh, you know, which plugin you'd use if you had more than one for some reason. You can pick how many months in the future you'd like to uh, grab events for. And then by default, it just gives you the title, start date, end date, we can add uh, different fields from within uh, the event descriptions and event data to include in your newsletter. So you can really just leave it as is, hit generate newsletter formatted events. And if you scroll down, you can see you've got the two events that I've got in the calendar that are happening within the next month with the start date and end date. And you've got the HTML. So you can now copy and paste this into MailChimp or into Constant Contact, Aweber, whatever email software you're using and have that newsletter send out to your subscribers. That's it. Any questions or feedback, be sure to let me know.